How um, does it feel like the reception that mm. you've gotten from Red Bat Society? Uh, it feels great. It feels really, um, you know, validating because we're we're putting in a lot of work down there. And we're having a great time, and and you know, to to hear from the fans and see the fans out there, and and you know, get that sort of recognition from them that they're they've been touched by the show or inspired. I mean, they have someone in the hospital that they know. I mean, it's really been. Uh, a, a pretty rewarding experience. Cool. You, you said you got a lot of reception on Twitter. Is there a comment from uh, one of your fans that really stuck with you in terms of just being like, because the show's very heartwarming, you yeah. know, so just in terms of that. Uh, I, it's the it's the personal ones. I've gotten quite a few, um, you know, ones where, where kids are in the hospital and they, uh, they're they tweeting out their red bands that they're wearing and that uh, they the patients get together and watch the show and like that, you know, that's that's something that, you know, you can't you can't fake and it's uh, it's real. So it's cool. And what's the weirdest tweet you've gotten? I, I actually just got a funny one. I got a... Uh, this this young lady, I guess, asked uh, work to stop dyeing my hair to look more like Clooney uh, to leave me alone. That I was a good enough actor, and I was like, who would dye their hair to get grayer? I was like, oh, she must be young. I was like, I'm certainly not going. I'm on a one way track. I'm, I don't need to fast forward that at all. So you're saying you know? this is all natural? Oh yeah, that's what happens when you marry a Cuban, right here. It just comes in hot. Cool. And what other projects are you working on right now that you're most excited uh, well, about? Well, we're just sort of tied to, to work for a while. You know, I mean, we're hopefully going to be there till uh, next March or April. So, uh, you know, hopefully, hopefully that hopefully that's where I'll be. Okay, cool. And were there any nominees today that you were also very excited about? Any favorite shows of yours? Well, you know, I'm a, a little biased, but Octavia Spencer, I mean, uh, it was very, very nice to hear her name. I mean, she's such a great team leader down there, and uh, we all just uh, are completely in love with Octavia, so it was really nice to see.